kids love playing with bubbles, whether it's bubble gum or maybe the kind you make with the magic wand. Kitchen pantry scientist Liz Heineke here this morning. Liz, great to have you with us. Nice to be here. Nice to see you guys. The family loves bubbles. We Every had, family does. Oh, my God. My kids and I had so much fun playing with bubbles to set this up. Awesome. So, I'm going to show you some fun experiments we did that are on my website. I actually got organized, got them on my They're website. They're on there. Uh -huh. Excellent. Yes. Yeah, so the first thing you need to do, you can do this with just Blue Dawn and water. So you don't have to go buy them. You don't have to go buy anything. But I actually add things like glycerin, cornstarch, the recipes on my website, but to make, or in this book, to make um, the bubbles last longer. A little bit stronger yeah. with that, those thickening So bubbles agents. are basically just water and soap, right? Mm -hmm. Sure. What water, what the soap does, it's called a surfactant, and it breaks oh. the surface tension of water, and so you get this nice little sandwich. You might want to move your iPad a little, right, Jason. Sure. So I'm just... I have a piece of glass set on a tray here, and I'm spilling all over. That's okay. But we are just going to use straws to blow bubbles. So, oh, why don't you guys go ahead, grab a straw, dip okay. it in the bubble solution, and see how you can blow bubbles with a straw. Oh, just with a straw? Yep. You oh, can also use fun. the bubble one. But what we're going to uh -huh. do first is use static electricity <laughs> to move yeah, a bubble at, around. Look so, at all that's going on. I know. Okay. I'm having, bubble in one hand. I'm having kind of a bad hair day anyway, so I'm really <laughs> doing I don't know about that. Okay, oh, so oh, I have cool. a bubble on this detergent, on uh -huh. the glass. Yeah. With static electricity, oh, it popped, but I'm going to try it again. You can use static electricity to make these bubbles move around, and that's just because you have a charge on the balloon. Can you oh, see that? Yeah, look, yeah at that. look at that. And then you have all the water molecules in the bubble line up and you can pull the bubble around. So it's oh, kind of like yeah. a pet bubble. And look at all the yeah. other bubbles Isn't kind of that on cool? the thing moving around, around too. That's cool. Okay, the next thing oh, you guys, grab, grab another <laughs> straw. Okay. We're going to blow a bubble in a bubble in a bubble. So you're just going to dip your straw in here. Okay. So bubbles are really elastic, right? Yes. And you can actually poke a straw through them and they won't pop. So we're going to blow bubbles on these plates. So on if you guys plates. scoot over, I'll show you. Okay. We're going to blow a bubble on the plate. Okay. Can you see that? Blow it oh, big. Look at that. You got to do one too, Jason. All right. Then you're going to get more. You're going to put your. Look at my bubble. That was, I feel pretty good yep, about it. Get this. a little more oh, detergent. Are you trying to get it to be bigger than mine, Jason? Nope, you can have the big one. <laughs> get a little more detergent <laughs> on your straw and try to blow a bubble in your bubble. Okay. And Kylie, why don't you actually do one on that plate right there? You want to do one on the plate? I'm going to move the bubble mix over for Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Because so. the bubbles are kind of scooching over, so blow a big bubble right on the plate. Okay, okay now get, dip your straw in again. Okay. And blow a bubble inside that bubble. Just, so just put it right inside so there. Put it down on the plate. Right yep, put it on the plate. Okay, now stop. Oh, okay. I, I made it. Oh, oh, yep. oh, oh If no. you look on my website, though, you can actually blow like <laughs> multiple ones inside. Multiple ones inside. You can blow like four or five bubbles inside other bubbles. That's so cool. So Isn't that cool? Do it a little bit smaller. So Yeah, so oh, do right the second there. one a little bit smaller. Well, a little tricky. Probably but very cool. There you go. There Probably it is. That one. See that? Yeah. So you can blow like three or four. That's awesome. Okay, Caroline. now this one is the coolest. Yeah, look at that. I got out my glue gun. You can do this with Play Doh and straws or a glue gun and straws. Okay. I made cubes out of straws. Can you see that? Yeah. Aren't they pretty? Nice. Well okay, done. Okay, anyway. So I'm going to dip them <laughs> in the bubble solution. Right. You can do it too. When I pull them out and shake them, it is going to form a little bubble prism. So go ahead, see that? Oh, right yeah. Go ahead. You can that do it with one's the big too big. One? Kylie, why don't you do it with the small one? <laughs> okay. So yeah. can you see I have the bubble prism here? Then I'm going to blow a bubble and drop it on top of that prism, and it is going to make a square bubble inside. Come on. This, I got to blow a bubble first. I didn't do a very is, good bubble prism. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh wow. They kind of collapse. Yeah, and you see it in the middle. Can you see it it's in like the a middle? Spider web. Be become a square. Yep. Though. Actually, if you just blow on, it'll be a square. So go ahead oh. and. All right. Yeah, Kylie's you got to get gonna, it covered. Well, Kylie anyway. works on that. I'm going to remind you that Liz has all of this on her website. Uh, go to WCCO.com. It'll get you to KitchenPantryScientist.com. You can get all of these bubble experiments. There it is. Experiments. Check Let's it out. There a there square it is. bubble. Perfect. I love that. This is Isn't great. Fun? You know, yeah, this was really fun. Bubbles in winter. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. No matter where you're at, it's really great. We're